Hello there, I'm Leo Wardock for Kit Guru, and this is another of our updates on the OCZ ARC100 SSD project we've been running. Um, I'm not sure which is the bigger bit of news, that I've got a third dead SSD, or that one of our SSDs has now hit 400 terabytes. Uh, let's just recap. Just recently, we've got two dead SSDs. I predicted drive F would fail next. I was wrong. Drive F continues to go well. In fact, drive H has failed. Not that matters. So third dead SSD. This one did 384 terabytes, turned up its toes, and that was that. Uh, the two remaining SSDs, drive F has hit 400 terabytes and drive G, as of this moment, 394.8. So it really feels like it's gonna do 400, um, but I cannot actually say that just for the second. In round money, 395. So 400, 395, we're going well. And the third dead drive. Uh, as it happens, and we, ha we had a slight unusual thing happen here a couple of days ago, where the power went out three or four times in the course of an afternoon and evening. Happens very rarely around these parts which meant, of course, the test system was shut down uh, rather rudely while it was running away. Um, uh, it's a funny thing. I actually had no doubt in my mind the system would start again nicely and the SSDs would behave properly, and they did, because the one thing I know for an absolute fact about SSD firmware after my visit to OCZ UK is that pulling the plug on the things is something they do all the time. It's, it's almost the worst case scenario for an SSD is that when it uh, gets shut down, and then restarts, it can't find the file table and everything just goes to pieces. Uh, that side of things worked absolutely perfectly. Um, it was everything else that really went wrong. So the third driver just reached the end of its life and we've uh, drives four and five continue. 400 terabytes, 395 terabytes, big landmark. I do not realistically think those two remaining drives have much left in them. However, I will be stunned if they get to 500 terabytes, but let's face it, I was wrong about which driver fail next. So who knows? Anyway, this is Leo Wardock for Kit Guru and uh, yet another dead OCZ SSD.